take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. The most common benchmark percents are 0%, 10%, 25%, 50%, 75%, percent, and 100%. These benchmark values are sometimes used when estimating a solution involving percentages. Real-world example. If an item costs $36 and there is a 7% sales tax, the benchmark of 10% can be used to mentally estimate the sales tax of the item. Let's help you make your mark. How are benchmarks calculated? The scores that make up the benchmarks are simply the average scores for the particular group you are comparing to. If you are looking at average factor scores for your organization for 2018 versus 2017 you are comparing the average score for this year versus the average score for last year. Take our lead. A benchmark is a point of reference by which something can be measured. The total context against which all products are measured and compared is referred to as the benchmark. 2. A program that is specially designed to provide measurements for a particular operating system or application. Let's help you make your mark. Benchmarking is used to measure performance using a specific indicator, cost per unit of measure, productivity per unit of measure, cycle time of X per unit of measure or defects per unit of measure, resulting in a metric of performance that is then compared to others. Take our lead. This is essentially the percentage difference between the benchmark number, 120, and the new number, 150. You calculate the percent variance by subtracting the benchmark number from the new number and then dividing that result by the benchmark number. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.